My name is Mark Kielberger, co-founder of Free the Children. Myself, my brother Craig, and our entire members of the Free the Children team and family would like to add to the words of sorrow and loss felt by the world community as we come together to remember Nelson Mandela. Mr. Mandela's legacy is one of peace, social justice, and a more just and humane world for all of us. I remember once I had an opportunity to have a quiet moment with him. We're at Oxford University celebrating the launch of the Mandela Road Scholarship, and I asked him a question. I said, Mr. Mandela, how did you do it? Spending all those years in Robben Island, all those years in solitary confinement, all those years when, of course, hope and despair would have been all of our answer. And he looked and he said, for me, it was easy because I deeply believed in what I did, but he said, quote, I led my sheep from behind. And it's that spirit and that legacy that allows us all to have a chance today to celebrate what this man stood for, what he deeply believed in, and how he set an example for all of us. Free the Children deeply believes in the spirit and the power of education to change the world, and Mr. Mandela certainly was one of the world's greatest teachers. And it's that spirit, the spirit of possibility and the spirit of education. He once said education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. This is our year of education. We're building schools throughout Africa. We're engaging young people to really understand what it's like when we can use that tool, the power of education, to make the world more idealistic, more just, and to be able to be, like Mr. Mandela himself, a dreamer. And even though today, as a human race, we come together to mourn the loss of one of our greatest leaders and one of our greatest inspirations. To all the young people, especially watching today, this is our opportunity. Our opportunity to take that baton, to set the example, to learn and to lead, and to have the opportunity to truly leave the greatest gift one could do to honor Mr. Mandela, and to truly lead our sheep from behind, to inspire and to be inspired, to engage and to engage others in the legacy and the values and what he stood for, for us truly to be the change. This is now our time, this is now our opportunity, and this is what he would want for our world.